Okay, hi everyone. I'm, I'm Stefan from Heidelberg University, or more specifically from the Heidelberg Institute for Geoinformation Technology. And I will show you how you can have custom OpenStreetMap extracts in almost almost real time using a little tool I wrote for the Open Root Service. The Open Root Service we are having at the Heidelberg Institute for Geoinformation Technology has been around since about 10 years. Um, it's fully based on OpenStreetMap, free and open source software, and offers a free API for routing and isochrons and geocoding. Uh, so that, that's just the background. Because over time, the Open Root Service evolved and had new requirements. We all heard a lot about disaster mapping in the last days and today, I think. But for disaster mapping, what you need for on firmos is um, up-to-date data and up-to-date routing graphs. But um, the graph update and updating the data is very, very slow. So one solution we, we applied was having uh, individual instances for individual regions, which very much speeds up graph generation. So in the end, it basically looks like this. We can have a little, little checkbox down there um, where you can choose the, the region, and then it just switches instances. But still, you need up-to-date data, and this is where my little project came in, um, which is called Realtime OSM to provide custom OpenStreetMap extracts. So what it does, it provides a little uh, an API and a dashboard where you can basically create update tasks for uh, extracting OpenStreetMap data. Um, it, the whole thing is based on a Node.js server. It manages all the update tasks or jobs in an SQLite database, keeps them up to date, um, and provides a low-level API where you can, which you can actually use uh, from your other applications or uh, this web front end we have seen. The whole update strategy goes to, like, goes about finding and downloading the smallest Geofabrik extract for your area of interest and crop it. But if you don't want to do this, we also have uh, Planet File support so you can actually supply a Planet File. And then afterwards we keep it continuously up to date with uh, OSM update. If you, if you want access, we, have, uh, we ho are hosting an instance right now and for the next two or three days, which you can uh, just put into your web browser and have a look at it. Or you can send us an email at uh, info at highgit.org. So this is from me. Um, I, will, I will keep this slide up, so you can maybe take a photo if you're interested. And if I have one more minute or something, I can still show you, show you the, whole, the whole thing. This is the web page, and this is our instance running. I created one for Milan, so you can basically have this map visualizing all, all your jobs, and the table show you information. Uh, the layout is it's a bit rough right now, so if you, if you break it, it's broke. Um, and then in the end, if you want to have the data, you can basically download the one from Milan, and it's downloading right away. Okay, thank you very much. Thank also to Stefan.